Welcome to the first episode of Taking on the Memes. In each episode, I will show you all a meme that's going around and explain how they get it so wrong. So let's check it out. Isn't it funny how the same people who believe businesses should be allowed to deny services to homosexuals are now outraged that businesses are denying them services for not wearing masks during a global pandemic? That sounds reasonable, right? If you want to refuse service to gay people over wedding cakes, then you shouldn't complain when a business won't serve you because you're not wearing a mask. So where do they get it wrong? No one's complaining that businesses shouldn't be allowed to require customers to wear masks to get service. People are complaining about the government forcing businesses to require that their customers wear masks. Government force is the problem. And that's the same issue with wedding cakes and venues. We object to the government forcing us to participate in something we don't believe in. It's not about masks or being gay. It's about liberty. Here in California, back in 2008, we voted to make marriage between one man and one woman the only marriage valid in the state. Leading up to that election, I asked many Republicans, Democrats, and Independents how they saw the issue. Predictably, most Democrats were against Prop 8, or how they referred to it, Prop Hate, and most Republicans supported it. Independents were a mixed bag. It ultimately passed, but the funny thing is, I would ask everyone I spoke to this one question. Do you think the government should decide who can or can't be married? And almost everyone said no. That's what we should have been fighting for. Less government control and more freedom. Conservatives are very much for letting people decide how to live their own lives. The problem is only created when you bring government into the mix. We don't want schools teaching our children about sex. We don't want to be forced to take part in something we disagree with like a gay wedding. And we don't want to be forced to close down our businesses or wear masks. I would like to add that if I was a baker, I would probably make a wedding cake for a gay couple. And if I owned a store, there might be a situation where I felt that requiring customers to wear a mask might be pertinent. It's just not the government's place to tell us how we're supposed to live our lives. In fact, it's the exact opposite. It's their role to protect our liberty so we can decide for ourselves how we want to live our lives. Furthermore, if you think it's okay that businesses deny service to people who refuse to wear masks, then why shouldn't a business be allowed to choose not to participate in something that goes against the owner's religion? Think about it and give me your thoughts in the comment section below. And if you have any memes that you want me to take on, you can post them there too. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, subscribe to our channel. And if you want to become a supporting member of Blue Collar Logic, click on the link in the description and give what you can. Thank you.